Ara, ara. Chickens can't be hags. V cheeky smiley face. Ara ara. Hags can be chickens though Valkyr 89 lol.
Hello, chat. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I gotta adjust. Be ways faster than kids do. It's all. It's that. It's that mad chicken energy. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? All right. Let me turn the music down a little bit. There we go. Hello. Hola, hola. Hello, guys. Um, happy Sunday. Happy Monday Eve. How's everyone feeling on this Monday Eve? Oh yeah, Kiwi vs VT. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the meat hall. Hello, hello, yellow. I think. All right, I just really want to listen to Go Getters, but I think now we will do lo-fi type vibes. So give me a moment to find my lo-fi type vibes. Where's my lo-fi type vibes? Where's my lo-fi? I want a cute lo-fi. Lo-fi. Wow, North! What? Oh, North! Holy shit! Thank you! Thank you so much for the ten gifts! Us. Thank you! Thank you, my dude! Thank you so much! Amazing! Amazing! Thank you so much! You see a totally? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You weren't here for this, huh? Hold on, I'm trying to. Here, wait. Like, my brain no worky today. Here we go. Let's try this. Let's try this. Am I supposed to be hearing sounds? I don't hear any sounds. Oh, there it is. There you go. Alright, that's a vibe. I'll try that. Try that. Was this one the morning shift? No, this was, um... Last Thursday? Last, last Thursday, I think. Was when I worked on this last, so... We're gonna vibe, guys. I am... I am tired. It's like a good tired, though. I had a big day today. So I'm a little eepy. But it's okay. I like that. But no, it was it was not a morning stream. It was a, an evening stream. But yeah. All right, so we're gonna work on the ca castle. We're gonna work on the castle today. This, 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 this beast right here. Um. Wow, my brain is shut down, dude. <laughs> How has everyone's Sunday been? Has everyone been chill? Has everyone been having a chill Sunday? Alright, I wanna like... Are you not brushing? There you go. There you go. I like the way this castle looks. I'm gonna kinda steal some info from it. No, I told you that already. That's not the setting. It's a commission. I can't just make like willy-nilly choices like that. Thank you, Kiwi. I up for 20 minutes and my arms are noodles. Oh no! What kind of workout did you do? I've had a good day. Hey! That's two of us then. I went to like a summer arts festival. Not summer fest for those in the know. I did not go to, I don't, I don't think I ever want to go back to summer fest ever again. But I went to a summer arts festival today and I, I got to look at some art which was nice. I like looking. I didn't like add as much art as I wanted to because the people I was with, they aren't massive art nerds, so they got very distracted by literally everything else. But that's okay. It's all right. Guided shit because I'm not particularly active, but I'd like to be. Oh my god, is that a vibe or is that a vibe? I'm also not particularly active, but would like to be. My favorite is to find the Pinterest workouts. <laughs> 
<laughs> That's always a time and a half. All right, so let's see. I want this to be a rock face here. That's what I do. Find the Pinterest workouts. <laughs> we do be streaking. Gamma's Gamma's got a hot streak going. <laughs> BRB laundry. Damn, he streaks and goes. I see how it is. Oh, you know what I should do? Give me a second. I should do this for you guys. Oh no. Where do I where should I put this? Where's a good spot to put this? Um, where is it? That's not like super duper blocking. Where there's no good spot for this, I don't think. Maybe I won't do this then, I guess. There's no good spot for that. <laughs> No clothes art stream? Are you, wow, Otter. You're trying to get me to stream naked? Are you going for the naked time? New vibe this year, eating fruit and vegetable. Don't talk to Gamma about vegetables, he'll implode. Alright, let's try to get some rocky shapes. Oh wait, no, no, wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold up, hold up. You do what you want. Amazing answer. Should probably be like this color, like a darker color. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. And then it should be. I'm trying to like establish light source at this point, guys. In case you're wondering why I'm scribbling. How would we know if you were though? New fear unlocked. That's right. You guys don't know. I will, um, I will say that there's been, I am currently wearing, uh, shorts, but there has been many a times that you guys don't know, but I was definitely not wearing pants. And there's sometimes I was not wearing a shirt. <laughs> I'm currently fully dressed at the moment, but <laughs> there has been times where I have not been. <laughs> uh... It's the power of the VTuber, man. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. It's random Coco saying that everyone here is loved and appreciated. Thank you, Coco Vixen. Thank you. You are too. Right. Right. Trying to think. Alright, this this back part here, this this the sky should be darker. Because um of the way the light source is. So we're gonna make the sky darker than the mountain. I am wondering something. What's up? Hopefully I can help. My ninja skills work here? Are you gonna ninja vanish? Or are you gonna assassinate someone in chat? Nope, nope. No ninja vanish here. That left tower is a penis. Man, I would have expected a comment like that from Buddha. <laughs> well, thank you for the follow, Coco, and welcome to the meat hall. I want to put the alert behind my head. I don't know why it's in front of my head. Nope, it needs to be above that, though. <laughs> there we go. That's better. It's gonna be it's gonna be like a chill vibey kind of night though, guys. So if you are working on something or if you kind of just need background sounds, it's definitely gonna be a vibey kind of vibey kind of day. You know what though? So I'm at this art show, right? I don't know what to call it. They called it a festival, but it wasn't like there weren't festivities. It was like you know, like it was like a vendors hall and that got a for convention, but for people with lots of money, which I don't have, right? Um, 
And I was like looking at the prints that some of these photographers have. And don't get me wrong, I'm not saying their work is not good because it was very, it was fantastic. It was nice. I, I like, I, I was like seriously considering buying some prints, right? Which is saying something considering I don't like spending money. So like, that's how good these were. That's how, that's how nice these were, right? One print, one A5 print. Um, for several photographers, not just like one or two Z's, like several, like three or four of them, they were 85 bucks a print. And I almost keeled over because, holy shit. <laughs> <coughs> Like, I sell my prints for $15. <laughs> I'm starting to think I should, like, raise my print prices or something. And people were buying prints. And I was like, holy shit. Now, granted, this is, like, a fine art type situation. So, like, it's a little bit of a different ballgame. But still, the price difference there was astounding. I almost choked right there in the booth. I was like, holy shit. And the person was like, do you have any questions? And I wanted to be like, how how do people buy these? But that would have been rude. That would have been really rude to say something like that. But And like, again, I'm not saying it to be rude. Like, it was good work. I just wasn't, that price was crazy to me. I don't, I don't understand disposable income, apparently. Because I, I don't know. You know what I mean? Mine are just fart sniffers. I bet they didn't have a black and white Elvis picture. I didn't get around to every booth, but I did not see a black and white Elvis picture. I did see um, this guy did these really cool things where like he made um, homemade paper from like fiber. And then instead of like painting a picture on the homemade paper from fiber, uh, he like pulped down uh, different colored fiber um, so it was really really like fine and then he was able to put in a squirt bottle and then use stencils and he basically like used the paper to make a design on the paper and it was really cool and they looked really and it was all cute birds and I wanted that too but those were like those were even more expensive I think those are like 90 for a print print quote unquote it's not a print they're all handmade so like that the price the price on that one makes a little bit more sense to me made a tapestry no 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 it's not a tapestry tapestry is like sewing it wasn't a tapestry it was like he sprayed he pretty much sprayed paper fiber on top of wet paper fiber but it was I, I don't know how to explain it he like explained it I was like, I felt really special because he like explained it to me and I was like, dang, he like sought me out and explained it. Was, that's nice. That's cool of him to do that. You know, I'm pretty like nice. And then like he said the exact same words to the next person that was standing next to me. And then I was just like, well, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> I'm not actually cool. <laughs> like some strange paper mache sculpting painting thingy. Sort of. Um, it was so flat, but yeah, that's kind of a closer idea. I don't really know how to explain it. Like, um, I don't know, for people that don't know how to, like, make paper at home, right, you take, like, like, you can do, use recycling, like, um, fuck, what's it called? Junk mail. You can use, like, junk mail and, like, um... Basically, you just grind it up in, like, a paper shredder, and then you soak it for a really long time, and then you, like, put it in a blender, and you basically break it up so it's all its, like, individual fibers, right? And then you can use, like, a screen, like a mesh sieve-type screeny guy, and then you can kind of make the paper come back together into, like, paper. Paper shape. Um, so, like, he did that to make, like, the paper shape with the screen, but then he like continued that and ground up more paper even more so it was even finer so that he could put it in a spray bottle he said um and then like would lay a stencil over the wet paper he just made and then would spray it with the colored paper pulp and then like it would be like a color
Any of the photo prints of exotic places? If they were exotic places, they weren't like listed or anything. Like there was some that were like cacti, you know, so like obviously that wasn't in my state. Um, but a lot of it was like barn doors, you know, like barns in the middle of a field. And like, um, there was a cool horse one, but it was, you know, it was a horse. You know, you know what I mean? Like, the only just like super, like, one I could tell was the the cactus that like obviously wasn't in the area. Just playing a whole desert in your backyard. Ah, oh, goose. There was polka though. They played polka, and I I wanted to implode. So you'll be happy to know there was polka there. Wait, people will buy pictures of the barn. Shit, I got a bunch of those. Around. Yeah, dude. No, no, no. Like, for real, though. Like, it was like a picture of, like, a barn in a field. Now, granted, there was, like, a cool thunderstorm, like, going on in the background, but I can't help but assume that that was, like, photoshopped in. I'm gonna be honest with you. There's no way. It's just, like, all that was too perfect. I, I have a hard time believing that someone just sat in a field and waited for a thunderstorm. You know what I mean? I'm not saying it's not possible, but I feel like it's unlikely. Don't ask for the horse tail. Wait, what horse story? Which horse story? There's lots of horse stories. There's one from last night where Meow Mix couldn't believe that horses could walk sideways. That one was funny. Were you at a flea market? No, it wasn't a flea market. It was a it was an arts festival. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely not the cleaning one. Oh, that one. I don't know why you guys think that's such a weird thing. You guys can like just simply Google it if you really want to know more about it. It looked physically impossible. Horses are actually um they can move in some weird weird ways. Um but that's because they're prey animals. Horses are considered prey animals, so they are, um, they're relatively agile animals. A oh, Nordic festival, that sounds amazing. Um, why Google when I can ask the expert? I'm not the expert by any means. I wouldn't consider myself an expert. Um, but no, you have to... For those who don't know, if, if you have a male gilded horse, which means he's fixed, he's not intact, you have to clean his his pee pee. You have to clean the wee wee, or it gets beans in it, and then it can cause an infection, and then your horse is crippled because his pee pee has infected beans in it. I'm not explaining any further. If you want to know more, simply Google infected horse beans. <laughs> No balls. <laughs> Beans. Bruh. Peen crippled. Sorry, but donkeys are cooler than horses. Yeah, are they? Can you explain to me why? Can you support your argument? Hello, Tsuna. I see you came for the... Uh, a horse pee pee talk. Very on on uh on brand for you. There, Suna. Now, if only bleach were here, that would be perfect. It'd be the trifecta of pee pee <laughs> trifecta of pee pee talk. Donkeys are kind of pricks sometimes, but they can be giant dogs. Came for the hag breeding? No. No hag breeding. We're not breeding hags. Do people breed hags? Is that something people do? Oh yeah! 
Oh yeah, I suppose I should talk about the title since I have it in my title. I forgot. I'm like, why did you bring up Hag randomly? It makes sense now. I'm so dumb. <laughs> I mean, what else are you supposed to do with them? All right, isn't Hag like a horse term? Oh yeah. No, that's Neg. Neg is a horse term. But it's kind of similar. Similar. How would you get more hag? Yeah. Breading? Are we throwing bread at the hag? Bread, yeah. I made bread today too. God, I'm so busy today. Donkeys are hella herd animals. They can watch over herds of other animals. Oh, that's true. I grew up um, in Asgard with a donkey. His name was Donkey. He was in love with all mother's horse. It was kind of sad. Like, do you guys ever see that meme with like the really big girl, like the really big buff girl, and then the little the little lad that's like falling around like a puppy dog? That was my mom's horse and donkey. He was because he was a. Not only was he a donkey, but he was a miniature donkey, which is funny. <laughs> In small tried to D&D &D with chat, they did attempt to breed a hag. Damn. How did that go? I, I remember him talking about it, but I was wor I don't know. That's more of an undertaking than I'm willing to take on, I think. A short king. Donkeys and horses can make mules. Not those two. Those cannot. <laughs> those two would not be able to. Climb a giant bee. Yeah, my man didn't have the hyper. He came up to, like, below, like, his back was below her, like, just above her knees. Oh, yeah, with the bunny. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, she, because she was a, oh, God, what was she? Was she a quarter horse? I don't think she was a quarter horse. Giant bunny wife. Hag. Oh, yeah, yeah. Anyway, so, like, I was explained... I think it was Gamma, actually, that explained it to me. I was explained by... I think it was Gamma that hags are pretty much, like, the weeb form of cougars. Which explains why you guys wouldn't call me a hag. Because I'm not really a cougar. Per se. Yee. Yeah. Oh, that's really dark. That's okay. Perhaps from Old English, hegtes, hegtes, witch. Yeah, that's, well, yeah, see, the witch thing makes sense. I always thought hags were, like, witch-type vibes. Who's a cougar? V, are you a cougar? No, that's, a, that's, that's why I'm not a hag, because I'm not a cougar. I don't have cougar vibes. But Amelie apparently does. <laughs> An overhang of peat, a soft place on a moor, or a firm place in a bog. No hags are super old ladies and people use exaggerated when... No, no, no. Oh, so, okay, wait. So, well, see, by that definition, I would be a hag. That's why I'm confused by this. So either you're wrong or I am a hag. Like, I don't know. I'm confused, guys. Love me a good peat bog. Gross. Hag age is anyone over 30. Do you have a giant hat? I have two witchy hats. Can you make a meet and call it peat bog? I don't think that would be a good idea because then I think people would think I made, um, fuck, what's it called? What's the, what's the whiskey where you put shit, scotch, put actual shit in it? Me not hag, haven't yelled enough at children for being loud. Oh my god, you guys are really confusing because you gave me a definition that I fit and then you go, no, you're not hag. I don't understand. 
I'm at least 3,000 years old, guys. Years is years is old, guys. When does when does it when does it when is the cutoff? That's a thing. What do you mean that's a thing? That's scotch. Comes out of whether or not you can radiate goofy mom energy. You still got twenty something energy. I got twenty something energy. Damn. After all these years, I still got 20-something energy. You mean peated scotch? Yeah, shit scotch. The stuff that Shippo drinks. It's got shit in it. Hello, V. Hello, Mimo. I'm drawing. It's a commission, but it's uh, some adventurers looking at a castle in the distance. I do a stretch. Hold on a moment. Oh. Gamma's being nice about the 20 something. But I'm going to be honest, you're so mean all the time. I can't take anything you say seriously. You dumb meow meows. It's liking cats. V, when do comms open? They're open right now, my dude. They've been open. Oh, does my VGen command not work? Oh, I turned it off. Yeah, they're open. Hold on a second. Check the other. No, no, no. I'm on. I don't want to cry. Um, no, I'm on VGen now, sir. I'm not. I don't do my commissions through coffee anymore. Okay, hold on a moment. Give me a second. I turned. I remember. I think I turned them off for the. For the thing. Oh, I don't have a V-Gen one. I thought I did. All right, give me a moment. I will get it for you. Boom. There I am. There are my commissions. If I say nothing, that's being mean. I like this place, so I interact, but I'm grumpy. You're like, you remind me of the grumpy cat, tartar sauce. Hello, sushi. Goodbye, sushi. <laughs> An eternal collector of souls of the fallen is pretty young at 3,000. Damn. That's rude. I don't know. If, is that rude? Is that rude? <laughs> I only die if you guys make me too sad. That's how that works. Late 20-something energy. Early 20-something energy is like nuts. It's like, uh, yeah, I can't handle early 20-something energy. Arabian sand boas are marked as the derpy animals on the planet. It's very clear as to why you see They're so cute, though. I love them so much. Hello, Kaiser. Cat was an OG. All right, give me a moment. Give me a moment. I have to do something real quick. Uh, I think my thingy's not working again. Uh, no, it is. Okay, never mind. No Satch. Reaper's been at it for 5 million, V. You're basically a babby. 5 million? There weren't people around 5 million years ago, Otter. I... The Grim Reaper did not reap dinosaurs. That are wrong, right? Yes. But yeah, guys, if you want to commission me, my commissions are open. Please feel free. <laughs> feel free to do it, so. Were you there to know? I mean, I've talked to the Grim Reaper. There's a reason why he's people-shaped. I will, don't worry. But, as you already knew that fact, I must do another LOL. King Cobras, not only has they grow, they're also not real Cobras. I did not know that one! They're not real Cobras? What are they then? Why aren't they Cobras? You're telling me the King of the Cobras isn't actually a Cobra? 
He's a fake? A false idol? Do you do metalwork? What do you think? Like, if you had to guess. Do you recommend? Oh, Dino Blade! So good! It looks so cool. Well, they're more closely related to Mambas. They seem to look like Cobas via convergent evolution. Wow, that's crazy! I didn't know that. There's another animal. Oh! Oh, God. I can't remember what it's called, though. There's, there's an animal. I can't remember what it's called, but it looks like a furry potato. And it's small, like a rodent. But it's not a rodent. Due to convergent evolution, it's more related to a manatee. Or an elephant. Than a rodent. No, it wasn't guinea pig. Guinea pig is a rodent. No, also a rodent. Um, hold on. It's not a rodent. Oh, yeah. Rock Hy Hyraxes. Also known as rock dazzies or rock rabbits. Rabbit-like animals native to Africa. Hyraxes. It's, uh, it literally looks like a potato. Let me see if I can find a picture. Here. It's, it's, it's more closely related to an elephant than, like, other rodents. Let me zoom out. It's, it's not part of, like, the, the genome or whatever you want to call it isn't, uh, it isn't in the same line with rodents. It's, it's potato. It's a potato. A similar convergent evolution are the North American king snake and the coral snake. Both have the same physiology, but in different markings. Interesting. Beavers are precious. There is a reason us Americans did rescue mission and airdrop. Beavers are cute. Just not the one in our chat. He's not cute. It loaf. Yeah, so that's that's more closely related to a manatee than a rabbit. I'm sorry, Beaver. I have to be mean to you guys or people get confused. It's like someone stuck a rat head on an otter body and gave it diabetes. Anyhow, I'm just here to drop off lunch. Gotta go back to the corner. Have fun in your corner, Robo. Thanks for popping in. Alright, let me... Well, no, let me... Like... Oh, yeah, I'm gonna go I'm cute and hot. Thank you very much. Are you cute or are you hot? Are you like tomboy or are you like, what are you? All right. I'm just going to do the blip, 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 blip. Are cocas rodents or marsupials? I think they're rodents. I don't think they have pouches, but I could be wrong. I'm not an expert. I'm not an expert on them. I never actually saw one in real life. I am a beaver. You're a beaver that didn't even know you had a dam near you. How much of a beaver can you be? Beaver not worth a damn. Oh, did you see what I did there? That was a pun. That was a pun. Isn't that funny? What is then? What do you mean, what is then? Oh, burn. Got him. Fucking got him. 
Like, what is a marsupial? Is that what you meant? I'm just doing scribbles in the sky. Got to darken it up a little bit. Got to make it look a little bit more menacing. Marsupials, marsupials are mammals that have pouches. Yeah, like to be a marsupial, you have to have a pouch. If you don't have a pouch, you're not a mar marsupial. That's how that works. You're fake. Do cocas have a pouch? Do they have pouches? Oh, they do have pouches. Okay, I didn't know that. So they would be marsupials then. Oh my god, that's adorable. They're both so happy. That's so cute. It is part of the Animalia Kingdom. Rodents are mammals with a single pair of incisors in the upper and lower jaw that grow continuously. Oh, okay. A lot of Latin you're throwing in there, man. A lot of Latin. We don't really like Latin in these parts. Not a big fan, if you know what I'm saying. If you understand what I'm stepping in. Um, what about... What's another cute animal? Uh, capybaras. Big fan of the capies. The very cute. Very cute capybaras. We stand capybaras here. <laughs> Cappies are rodents, yeah. They're big rodents. They're big, friendly, too friendly rodents. They're they're friendly to a fault is their problem. <laughs> Apparently, who was it? Ken? Ken makes memes. He was telling me how, like, one of the countries he lived in, like, there was a problem where people would just, like, walk up to a capybara because they ate them. And they would just pick up the capybara and, like, walk off with it. Because <laughs> the capybara didn't try to run or anything. He thought he was just getting, like, a free ride. And he sort of was. But not to a happy place. Not to a good happy place. no natural predators in their homeland much like United States of America no natural predators here in the US to the American <laughs> cappies haven't got any brain cells yeah I uh, I, I I really vibe with the cappies <laughs> all right I'm gonna have to do some more of this color what the hell I always watch um, tutorials on how to like paint like mountains and rocks and stuff, and I still am very bad at it. <laughs> I cannot explain to you guys how many tutorials I've watched on how to paint freaking like mountain faces and stuff, and I'm still terrible bad at it. That's enough of them that none of them seem to mind when one tries to get a croc and gets snagged. Spicy. Spicy to the DNA. Yeah, hardcore. Paint blend paint. It's, it's a little bit more than paint blend though. Otherwise you end up with the, the curtain mountains. You don't want the curtain mountains, dude. At least Commissar is not here to tell me more rocks. Watch a video of a guy that just walked up to a honey badger, scooped it up by its torso and petted it before he yeeted it away. Why? Oh, Commissar, what the fuck? How did you do that? I thought you were doing things. I thought you were a busy man. Well, well, well. He pulling some foobie shit over here. 
remember a couple of guys making prop rocks and spray painting them leading to conversation of what do rocks look like? It's not it's not as simple as you'd think they would be, unfortunately. Got a commissar jump scare, dude. It ended earlier today. I went three five for the weekend. Oh, that's not too bad. I had never, I had never watched a match, like a 40k match before, so like watching that guy pull out the little, um, the little measuring tape left me very confused. Luckily the announcer people kind of explained what was going on, but I was not expecting a tiny measuring tape to come flying out like that. I was like, the fuck is this? The fuck is this? I was like, maybe he's just being like weird, like OCD about about where his minis are, and then, and then one of the announcer people were like explaining what all that meant, and I was like, holy shit! I've been sitting here watching chat talk to the schedule screen for twenty minutes. I don't know what Twitch did. Oh my god, Joey! <laughs> Honey matters gives your fucks about fences, fire, fire, electric fire. If they see something they want, they will get the thing, and it wanted eggs. In the background, obviously. Yeah, I'm sure I'm sure you're not grinding Elden Ring right now. I'm sure that's not what's happening. Oh, so uh it was actually Friggs that gave me a funny idea. Um, since the other day, uh he invited a bunch of people from the Discord. Um from the Discord to like use the co-op mod and uh, play Elden Ring and I was doing something else. I was trying to be a good girl and work and then I ended up opening Blender and I wanted to cry. So then they were in voice chats. So I just decided to jump in because the sounds of Frigg screaming made me feel better about Blender. Um, but I think it might be fun maybe if we could get like an event going. I don't remember how many people can go in a co-op game but if we could get a bunch of people into like a seamless co-op game that might be kind of belligerent and funny you are screaming i think it's more than four hold on a second Oh, five players in a session. Dang, I thought it was eight. But the modder who created it has also said that it can support up to 127 players. Wait, so what is it five or is it... What is it? Oh, the maximum player count in a party is 127. Only test it up to 15 players simultaneously in the newest update. So we could do 15 people. We could do 15 people. And we could just, we could. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Who did that? It didn't pop up. Who the fuck did that? Who did that? Who the hell did that? I didn't get that. I didn't get a thing huh. that you did it. 15 people, and we're all summoning the wandering nobles and the Oh, there it fight. is, Commissar! Why is it so delayed? Why is it so delayed? Holy crap. Oh, man. Okay, that was full body adrenaline. Thanks. I'm awake now. Thank you, Commissar. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so I thought it might be fun, maybe, um, I don't know if we would start over with new, um, I don't think it would be something we do, like, super duper regular, but maybe, like, every now and then, so I don't know if people wanted to have, like, their own, like, save file just for, like, the, the Mead Hall Elden Ring Nights, or if, you know, if we just roll in with what we got. 
Yeah, I don't. It's weird that's delayed on my end. Though normally it's delayed on your guys' end. Normally I don't have to worry about that. Hi, V. You're my content to drive home with. I hope you don't crash. I definitely feel like we could get 15 people to play Elden Ring at the same time. Maybe less, but that's okay. We can get. I feel like we could get a good chunk of people to play Elden Ring. <laughs> I think that would be funny. I wonder if we would do like a party comp. I don't like because I wonder. I wonder how. I wonder how hard the bosses would get because the bosses scale with how many people you have playing. I'm grinding other games. Damn, Goose is out. Goose is out of town, grinding other games. But yeah, I wonder how hard the bosses would be. Yeah, 100% extra bots HP per person. I think there was like something else that changed too. I can't remember what it was though. Like they do more damage or something like that. You have to get really good at dodging. That's that you have to learn how to dodge, Friggs. Bosses probably only scale to four person. No, no, no. It says it goes up to 15. Hold on. Okay, hold on, hold on. I'm reading, 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 reading. While co-op play does make the game objectively easier, it is not a completely different way to play the game. There are plenty of easy mode mods out there that just give you high health damage. The mod will be easier, but it's made to mind. Made in mind for those who want to play in the game in a whole way through with friends. It's been designed to have with fun in mind as opposed to reducing the challenge. That point is a raid battle. The mod goes up to 15, but the boss is only built to scale to 4. You know, but you can adjust it, right? In the in the file, instead of making it like 100% per player, you can make it 200% per player. So you could just like manually scale it. Getting slapped in heavy armor isn't too different. Oh yeah, armor doesn't matter. Unless you're using a shield. Just find the coolest armor you can find. And wear it. Wear it with pride. Break the game? Oh my god. Okay, so you could just manly, manually scale. But the fun part too is people like can drop in and out too. So like you don't have to come every night if you can't. You know what I mean? Alright, let's zoom out a little bit. Let's zoom out and take a look at this. Take a look-see here. It's getting better. Dude, dude, it's less blobby. It looks more mountainy. A little bit more ominous. But you can unintentionally break the game doing that. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Let's break the game. I'm not in my 20s anymore. I said you don't have to come every night. I mean, area boss bonds would be the only issue, though, where it could be a condition for that in the disco. Oh, like, what do you mean? I don't want to do any of these people right now because I don't want to pull up their references and it's just literally me being lazy and no other, <laughs> no other reason. You're so real for that. 
<laughs> oh my god, I'm so tired. I was like, I was considering like canceling the stream, but then I was like, I want to stream. I'm just really sleepy. Then I was like, oh, and I was like, but I want to stream. I don't want to cancel. So I ended up not canceling. So here I am, not canceled. I think he means if you buff world bosses and people are split up, then someone is getting Shreked. I, I've i noticed that you don't really split up, though, when you're playing with other people. I mean, you can, but I don't know why you would, honestly. Spite? I mean, look, if you go off on your own then that's and you die a lot, that's kind of on you, though. Like, I don't know. You know what I mean? <laughs> Cause I'm John Eldon. He's John Eldon. He must Eldon. He must Eldon the ring. Think about that millennia fight though, guys. Think about it. I haven't fought millennia. Um I'm trying to think of what What's my what? What are your guys' favorite boss fights? It usually happens because people die and get sent back to the last grace. If you wander off and get into it with a dragon alone, I'm not helping. I'm getting popcorn and letting it happen. My favorite are the easy ones. Gotta learn how to dodge. Fat Millennia, the Blade of McDonald's. Yes. I will say that the co-op mod has made Elden Ring actually fun, though. I will say. It's a lot more fun with, with, with friend. You know what I mean? Oh yeah, so there are a few 40k cosplays that were neat. Had an Admech sister battle and some dude brought in bits of Grey Knight Terminator armor they were working on. Oh, what? That's so cool. I didn't realize how big those halls were. Like, they like they panned out and there's like, what'd they say? Like 400 people in there or something like that? Like, that is crazy. All right, now it's going to start in two minutes. I'm tempted to get up and go get snackies, but I shouldn't go get snackies. So, like, I'm, I'm torn about what if I should just roll through the ad or if I should just go get snackies. If I hadn't opened a deodorant stand, they'd make it killing. <laughs> Am I right? Am I right? Go get snack. I don't, I don't know what snackies to get though either get snacks 400 plus where you get the largest group and there were half a dozen other game systems there too oh my god they were talking about like the narrative was it the story driven or like the narrative thing and then they were talking about generals and I, I didn't know what that was they said that, like, generals were there to, like, but then they were supposed to get, like, a a golden ticket. It was really funny. Well, I'm, like, I, I was going to say something in the chat, and I was, like, I am scared. I'm so out of my element. <laughs> it was very, uh, there was a lot, there was a lot going on. Oh, I don't know what snackies to get. The problem is, is if I get up and walk away, I might not come back. I might just go to bed. Because <laughs> I'm an EP bean. But I also want to stream for longer than, you know, an hour. Streaming's hard, guys. You gotta, like, manage stuff. You gotta manage junk. Come sleepy, I go to build. Builder of Big Bomb. It's true. Alright, I want this to be like round. 
Look, I even like look sleepy. I'm like, I'm a sleepy lad, so I'm going to hit the sack. Take care. See, everybody's sleepy. Have a good sleep, goose. Yeah, the top players who got golden tickets got expense paid trip to the world championships. Oh my god, this sounds amazing. An all expense paid trip. I feel like these need um, more windows, but smaller windows. So we're going to just paint over these. I remain awake. I'm still here. Oh my god. I have I have work in what time is it? Um math. Less than twelve. Less than twelve hours, guys. I'm about to stick the Calliope Mori back on so it keeps me awake. I have to watch more. I have to watch more Suicide Squad. Oh my god, you guys. I watched... Imagine working before 9 a.m. Pathetic. Shut up. Shut up, you cushy office person with your freaking... Freaking... You probably wear a lab coat and have like a name tag and shit. You probably have an office with a door. Do you have an office with a door, Argus? I'm just gonna stay awake. Damn, that's crazy. That's too much, dude. God, I wish I wore a lab coat. Only do that when we have wet lab stuff. Oh my god, not the wet lab. I watched the first Suicide Squad movie last night. Has anyone seen that? With Will Smith as Deadshot. Um, I'm trying to think of who else. I don't know. I mean, Margot Robbie's Harley Quinn. We all know that. Yeah, yeah, it's definitely a movie. Yeah, it was, um, I watched this, so I accidentally watched the second one first. Uh, because of how, like, how things ended up on my Plex. Um, so I accidentally watched the second one first, which didn't really affect it that much. I figured out part way that was the second one. But um it's I can't even yar har correctly. But man, that was like the second one's okay. The second one's pretty good. But that first one, I went in I went into it with a higher expectation because I'd seen the second one where I feel like they kind of recovered a little bit. A little bit. Well, no, so I was thinking of Calliope Mori, and that reminded me of Suicide Squad, and then that reminded me that I watched Suicide Squad yesterday. You do seem like you'd watch movies or shows out of order and go, I didn't like it because I didn't understand what was going on. No, like, I figured, well, because I was like, what the fuck's going on? And then I, and then I realized, but then I just kept watching the movie anyway. But yes, that's happened to me before. <laughs> Lord of the Rings. <laughs> Star Wars. <laughs> Uh, I house, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the meat hall. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, it's it's a better movie. It's still got weirdness in it, but it, the writing is a lot better. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. They it it felt like someone was actually awake when they were writing it this time. Not like the I don't know what the fuck happened with the first one. I was like, what is going on? What, like, like the romance thing between Flag, the 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 Navy SEAL guy, and like the, the witch chick was weird. Because that felt like, I understand why they did it. Like, it's kind of an important plot point, and they just kind of like glossed it over and were like, by the way, this is important. Swords literally came out out of order. 
I watched the I watched the prequels first, and then I just haven't been motivated to watch the other ones. And then, like, the witch chick, like, she was cool when she was all dark and scary. And then for some reason, they put her in, like, that weird outfit to make her look, I don't know, more intimidating, maybe? I don't know. She's way scarier with the, with the, with, like, the dirty witch vibe. And then, yeah, they put, and then, like, at the end, she turns back into the dirty witch vibe. And I'm like, why didn't we just keep her in dirty witch vibe? It was way cooler. Dirty witch vibe was way cooler! I'm a little bit salty about that that design choice. I'm not gonna lie. And then changed her voice and stuff. I'm like, just, just, I don't know. Well, and then the whole Suicide Squad thingy only happened because Waller fucked up and didn't have control over it. Like, it was literally something that she created. Like, Waller created all that. Amanda Waller. I'm like, wait a minute. You you started this problem. Dirty version of the witch was generally cooler. Yeah. Like, I would have liked to see a whole movie about her. Like, that whole shit. Because that was cool as fuck. I want, I want dirty witch movie. I want full length dirty witch movie. That's what I want. But, like, maybe a different actress. Like, she's okay. I can't remember what her name is in real life. Like, she's an okay actress. But, I don't know. She just didn't fit dirty witch. She did when she was Dirty Witch, but, like, outside of Dirty Witch vibe. She didn't have a Dirty Witch vibe. You know what I'm saying? You guys understand what I'm saying to you right now? Was Waller super fat or no? No, I don't want to say she was super fat. No. I wouldn't, I wouldn't use that phrase for her. I wouldn't call her like a fit supermodel, but I wouldn't call her super fat. She's not super fat in the anime. Huh. Images. Images. She's not super fat in the anime. Who said that she's super fat? Meow Mix, Friggs, we're gonna have a problem. That woman is not super fat. There's nothing super fat about that woman. Sir, if that's super fat, we're gonna have a problem. She's built like a 45, 50 year old woman that has a high stress job and probably doesn't even know what a gym looks like. That woman functions on nothing but cortisol and, like, the tears of other people, okay? I'm looking in the Discord. I'm looking. I'm gonna see what that crap you're talking about. What that shit? Oh, that one. That's not anime, Amanda Waller. Why is she on the villains wiki? Why is everyone on the villains wiki? Oh my god. Okay, yeah, she's kind of a brick house there. Okay, all right. You're redeemed. I, I'll agree with you there. She's wide. <laughs> wide load. No poo-poo head roll for you. She tried to kill the Justice League? Oh, I didn't know that. That makes sense. To be fair, Batman did. Yeah, he's not on the villain wiki. Is that supposed to be flag? It is Rick Flag. Oh god, Katana was really bad in Suicide Squad 2. Like the movie. Not the anime, but in the movie. It was not good. I was like, damn, they just they did her dirty, dude. They did Katana dirty. Oh, it's on the villain wiki because she's fed. <laughs> she's supposed to be fat like Kingpin. 
Main antagonist is a bit overselling her, but she is a surprisingly major one. Cadmus agent? Oh my god, wait, hold on, I've just activated the nerds. What happened? What happened? Weller actually cloned off a Supergirl, made her hot, then sent a team to murder the League and blow up their space station. What do you mean, made her hot? What does that mean? What do you mean, made her hot? She couldn't kill them without being hot first? Is that how that works? <laughs> Hold on, I got you covered. Oh man, I'm scared. I'm scared, guys. I'm scared. Is Fubi considered a main character? Hello, Terra Mundi. Hello, Raiders. Welcome, welcome. Thank you, Terra, so much for the raid. If you don't know me, my name is V. I'm the Valkyrie VTuber. I do art and gaming. Right now, we're doing some uh, art and yapping. So, thank you guys so much for joining the stream. Welcome, welcome. If you need to take a break, stretch your legs, get some water, please do so. Tara, how is your stream? Was it good? Make her hot means we're discussing the DC multiverse, apparently. That's that's what this is boiled down to. What shirt we put we played a bit of once human. Oh, I've heard a bit of that that. Is it good? Wait, this should be... Nope. Oh my gosh. It's certainly a game. Oh, dang. Okay. We've been having that kind of vibe here a lot today. <laughs> things are certainly things today. <laughs> Hold on a second. Is, is it scary? Is it a scary game? Oh, yeah, that's right. Commissar was playing that. Is it like action shooter or... <laughs> Once humans modern meme game plays like Pal World. Oh. It's not able to get into the server my friends all played with, so I just demoed around. Not very scary. It feels like FPS zombie survival with Eldris Horror. Oh, okay. That's kind of neat. I'm always down for a good Eldritch Horror game. Base builder with gotcha? Oh, no. Not the gotchas. Is it gotcha like uh, loot box gotcha? No, like Gachi. <laughs> Feels like Pal World, Gears of War, Ark Survival, but with tiny Eldritch goblins have dinos and piles. Amazing. I've always wanted my own Eldritch Gobble. Meow. Alright, we're just gonna have this staircase wall thing kind of just disappear into the ether as one does. We were, uh, we were, before you jumped in, we were talking about, uh, the first Suicide Squad movie and how that was certainly a, <laughs> certainly a movie. It was a thing. I watched it for the first time last night, so. Drop the picture in memes. All right, I'll take a look. I'll take a look. Oh, I don't go to meme channel. That's cool. That's Power Girl, dude. That that's power. That's literally Power Girl. Like, that's literally Power Girl.
Hold on. Damn it, just let me copy the picture. There, I got it. I got it, I got it, I got it. Ah, uh, shoit. Literally. Oh, wow, that's the tiniest picture. Literally Power Girl. I'm not going to get the popcorn bucket. No, I know exactly what you're talking about. I'm not getting the popcorn bucket. No. Nah. I don't gotta. I don't have to gotta do anything. Nope, no way. No, I don't want that bucket. I don't want the bucket. I don't want the alien bucket. I don't want the bagussie. I don't want the alien gussie. I don't want it. I don't know what the deal is with like the weird buckets now. I don't like it. They've been bad, 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 bad. I don't, I'm not a fan of the bucket. Don't make me, don't make me get the bucket, guys. Don't make me do it. I don't want to do it. It's nothing sacred. I kind of want to get the alien bucket. No, you don't. Stop. Stop this. No one goes to theaters anywhere. I haven't been to the theaters in like a year. I'd like to go again. I like the movie theater. They're just really expensive, so obviously I don't go on a regular basis. But, I do like going to the movie theater. Damn, I'm so late. Took a good nap though. Hey man, as long as- you, no, A good nap is worth it. I almost said a nap, nap pussy. My brain is broken. Help me, please. Lost my student discount? Damn. Hmm, Warlords or Deadpool? Oh man, brutal. It's okay, everyone else abandons me on Warlords night. It's whatever, Commissar. Whatever. Actually, hold on a minute. Wait. Oh my god, it's this weekend. Oh my god. Hold on, I have to text somebody. <laughs> it's this weekend already? I thought it was next weekend. I thought I still had a week. Oh my god. I have no time. Did you forget again? Yeah. No, I mean like we I'm I'm fine. I don't have I don't have anything going on on Friday. I have something going on on Saturday. Um so on like I'm good. I will be there. We will it will be happening. I just thought it was the other thing is happening on Saturday and I thought I still had a week to do stuff. Oh, shame. Going to the Brewers game on Saturday. Oh, dude. <clears throat> no. I'd rather die. Guess she hates us. I can't stay late, though. Because I have to get up early on Saturday. But I'm not driving, so I could sleep in the car. So maybe I could stay a little later. Maybe. So I made $12. Let's go. Saturday Brewers game. Sunday baby shower. You're a busy man. Get fucked up in Warlords and nap in the car. Win win. Oh my god. Meow. Alright. Well, if that's the case, I thought I had another week left to work on stuff. <laughs> Shoy!
Why is this going so fast? It's not supposed to be August already. By the way, August Warlords um might be canceled. <laughs> Speaking of. I won't be around that almost entire yeah, I won't be around that week. Um I'm gonna be out of the state. So that entire week I'm gonna be out. So I don't know if um it kinda, I don't know if we wanna move it up a week or if we wanna uh, for August or or just cancel it or or, or what. Like I don't know. It kinda depends on how people's schedules are if I know, I do, I do hate you all. Probably move it back. I can't do the week after either. Gonna popcorn bucket me in August, got it. No! I can do the week before, but I can't do the week after. So if we are gonna do it, we'd have to do it the week before. Is pretty much how that would have to work. Can you do it the week before next week? No. I cannot. That would be this week. Can you do it right now? No, I'm streaming. What do you guys want to do for Warlords? Did we, we didn't even decide on what we were going to do. I didn't cancel this week. We're, I'm going to be there. I didn't cancel this week. No! I'm so confused! No, this... No, this month... Yes, oh, Jesus, I'm not prepared at all. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, thank you. Okay. <laughs> Meet up in a parking lot and fist fight. Winner gets $20 commission discount. Okay, bet. There's a... There's a Waffle House. There's, I think there's a Waffle House near Arcus. So we're going to all go towards Arcus. Um, I, I would rather uh, stab myself in an eye in the eye than play Lethal Company with a large group of people ever again. I'm going to be honest with you. It's not just, it's just, it's not just like a specific group of people. It's a, any large group of people. I would rather Toaster Beth. I'm ready to go against Arcus too. I feel like you gotta vet it more, but yeah, once it's like plus eight, plus, the company gets a bit funky. To see who sucks less. That's not very fun though either. No, it's just, my problem is, is like, I don't play it a whole lot, so I don't have the maps memorized, and then by the time I even like get to like the areas where stuff is it's already looted and then i just die and then it's just people fucking memeing and spamming emotes and stuff and it's just it, and it, i i haven't the only time i played lethal company and not gotten a migraine after was the last time when i played it with like next pickle and and i think it was dev that is the only time i've ever played lethal without getting a migraine so i just would rather not fucking play lethal at all to be completely honest with you It's too, it's too much for me. I'm, I'm too, I'm not Zoomer enough for the Lethal Company. Warlord Zomboid Night? I haven't, I've never played Zomboid. Which I got a five, or, wow, why did I read five? Which I got a six gig update? What? We could also check out some of the new games that are like built into Discord because they just added a whole bunch of games too. Pico Park, everyone that joins Warlords Night, I'll buy it for you. What's Pico Park? What's that? Discord does have games. It does. 
I do big stretch. Ah, uh, my back. Oh. The cat ladder game? What's that? Two to eight players. I th we might have too many people for that. It's hard to tell these days. Some days we get like six people. Some days we get fourteen people. It's hard to tell. I think I think figuring out what we're playing ahead of time makes it easier. I meant to like do a, a poll like forever ago, and then it just hasn't happened. I've been I've been spending more time at big girl job, and it's been draining the brain. A lot of people will like not actually click interested on those events. I wish they did, but they don't. I'd make my my life easier if they did. Just saying. Just saying, guys. kind of carving stone right now you want people on the internet to commit I know I don't even want you to commit I just want you to click the button and then like at least click the button because then at least I know you get like you for sure get notified of my streams and stuff like then I know for sure it's like a double whammy you know what I mean no one clicks it I think a lot of people use it for the uh the time conversion like they just look at it but now I'm doing it in the schedule thingy ma jigger. Ma who's it? Ma what's it? Ma hooba dink. Oh yeah. So then like the art thingy I was at, right? So then I'm like looking at other booths and like this guy's selling pizza cutters, which is like kind of whack, but it's like hand turned handles, right? And I'm like, oh well, that's neat. You know, that's that's some fancy shit, right? $45 for a pizza cutter for a hand turned handle. And I'm like, I get it. It's hand turned. You put like work into this. They're beautiful handles. But who has that kind of money to just buy that? You know what I mean? Like maybe Arcus. Arcus probably has a hand turned pizza cutter. It being on Friday still throws me off a bit. I put a thingy out. Double quarter. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the meat hall. Thank you. Thank you. But yeah, I don't know. I like I saw that for the the forty five dollar pizza cutter, and I was like, that's a that's a meal. Like that's food. You know what I mean? Like that's a meal. The fuck do you mean hand turned pizza cutter? Don't all pizza cutters turn by hand? No, 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 no. So the handle was made of like mahogany or something like that. Like some Hello. kind of wood. I am home. Welcome home, Bletch. Um, like out of wood that he turned on a lathe and then added the pizza cutter cutty bit. What's that called? A blade. I <laughs> killed a family of three. That that sound isn't that doesn't surprise me. I'm out of water. This is a sad day. It's like he didn't make the metal bit. I'm assuming, although they they were like uh, they were blah, blah, blah. they were like custom engraved too, so I'm sure those costed a pretty penny. I don't know. I don't. I don't. I don't know, man. I don't know. Obviously, people were buying them if he was making them, but I couldn't. Which then made me feel bad, because I feel like I'm, like, loitering in these people's booths. Because I do like looking at their art, but that part's f free. Ah, um, for something like that, I'll stick with the Cutco pizza cutter I got, but I could probably carve shittily one myself if I wanted to one. They were very pretty, I will say that. I don't know, maybe if you're, like, had- maybe if you're one of those people that were, like, really into pizza. 
And like you you had already dumped a bunch of money on like a wood fire oven. I could see I could see then you know getting a a hand turned pizza cutter. It's not illegal to stare. Probably more of a gift than for yourself to add some flair to it, maybe. All right, V, what's the plan for Warlords? Um, Widget? <laughs> Arcus threw a game suggestion in? Arcus did? So one of you did? King of the Castle. That looks familiar. So the monarch of the medieval party game navigate hilarious world of politics, treachery, an all-out rebellion as your decisions on Empire flourish should come crashing to your feet. King of the Castle is a multiplayer game, shifting power dynamics from tree. Host games of 3 to 24 players should join us loyal no Oh, that sounds fun! Oh, and only the host needs a game? <gasps> that sounds fun! I'm working that evening, but if this Warlords will be good, I can probably cancel my ship. Do you want to do political intrigue and backstab and become a, a, a political... A tyrant leech. Nice. Okay, so right now, uh, King of the Castle is looking like we're gonna get, cause then I can just buy the game, and you guys don't have to buy the game. And it looks fun. Are people gonna make it? I don't know. Ask the people. Commissar is gonna go see Deadpool, cause he hates us. She'll buy the night before, right before stream. It's true. Caboose, Caboose, you don't have to buy the game. I can buy the game. Kami, as your mod, you have to cancel. Don't need to buy it. You can be poor and still play it. Oh, you don't have Warlords here anymore. Oh. I thought you did. Huh. Brutal. Warlord Gym Knight? How? How? How do Warlord Gym Knight? Like we all work out at night at the same time? No, no, no. See, I'll play Elden Ring and I'll stream it to the Discord and then every time I die, you guys do an exercise. We all lived on a video conference. <laughs> VR escape room. Oh, I could. I have a. I have a. I have an Oculus. The pores. We all live together forever. Warlord's boxing tournament. Let's go. All right. I think I'm gonna finish shading these rocks. And then, um, I, as much as I don't want to call it a night, I am getting very eepy, and it's hard to keep a conversation going. Please, I, I feel like you can't box. If I get a job, I'll join Warlords again. I got super butthurt earlier this month. Aww. Do we need another sound alert? No. No, we really don't need another sound alert. I'm scared. I'm scared of the sound alerts. Commissar's like, I'm just here to keep the streamer awake. Bang! I can't buy Beaver Warlord status. No, you would have to, like, give him $3 or something. Like, the bot doesn't... I can't... We can't do that anymore. Not like back in the day. Things became more complicated as I grew, you know. How'd that go? The bot will literally freak out and punt him. Which might be kind of funny. It might be worth the three dollars. <laughs> Jesus 
Christ, I hate you. I hate you so much. I hate you. I hate you. I hate. I hate. Big hate. Goodbye. I hate. Okay, so the funny part is, is I hit the end button on my stream deck, which means I'm on a timer and it's going to end no matter what I do in like two minutes. So I guess we're just going to end the <laughs> So, um, I stream. We're going to do something cozy on Tuesday. I don't know what yet. Probably a game. I'll probably try like Supermarket Simulator or maybe a House Flipper. Well, maybe a House Flipper. I'm only your mom, the hoe. Um, yeah, I meant that I was like, I'm just going to swap over and then I automatically hit the button. <laughs> Dicks! Oh my god! You guys suck. <laughs> Gunshot literally killed stream. I flinched, dude. But yes, and then um Thursday, you guys, please come to Thursday's stream, you guys. You get to help make an emote. You get to help make an emote, so show up to Thursday's stream if you want to have like history in the making type situation. But yeah. Um, I will see you guys then. Uh, otherwise, have a good night. Um, I wish we could raid. But I don't I don't let me just Nope, we're done. We're done. Stream deck just died. I can't raid quickly. But thank you guys so much for coming and have have a wonderful night. I don't know when it's gonna kill it. I don't know when it's gonna kill it, but probably soon.